Okay, so in this video, I want to talk about is uh, tattoos, and I want to talk about different styles and this kind of thing. So yeah, um, the first thing is that, for example, if we talk about uh, tribal, and tribal means different styles of different culture in tattoos. For example, Maori. Maori people, people in New Zealand, uh, Maori, sorry, and people in Australia, like the Aborigine, and the Haida, and many, many, many more uh, different people from different world uh, places. And so, for example, uh, for example, so when when you talk about example, when people say that uh, tribal style is not longer it's good one thing is i can say is very very good that is uh, that tribal is not mainstream because uh, for it's much more then you have much more development and much more opportunity to do things that nobody else have uh, with that style i don't say that if you take, for example, inspiration, for example, if you, if you know how Ar Aborigine art look like, uh, or you look like art in, uh, for example, in, in Congo, or you look at art in, uh, in uh, the Haida, in Canada, like the Haida, or you look at art in uh, Borneo, or in uh, the Philippines, uh, or in an uh, ancient tribe in, uh, in China, and you look at different style they have, uh, then you see it's very few. In, it's very few people who have styles from the Aborigine in Australia, or have styles. So, for me, when people talk about tribal, is for with two different words of tribal. You can say tribal and historical tribals, tribes uh, with their style. It's very diverse from different culture around the world. Then you have, I can show what typical, uh, now this is a band logo uh, on my arm, but this is, uh, is a tribal, it's for Sofline. Uh, uh, here, this, uh, this one is a Sofline uh, logo. This is where I think what, when you talk about like classical tribal style. And uh, this one, then you have, uh, then you have like this one, the moon here is much more um, like it's a Haida kind of style. Uh, Haida, this one, and this is a classical Haida sound. This is a moon, this is a Haida inspired. Okay, this is a Haida inspired style, uh, with uh, this, not a Haida. Uh, mythical creature is an ichosaur, prehistoric uh, animal. This one. So yeah. So it's very much. It's very. I think tribal is the most complicated thing to identify as a, f a thing because you have so many different way to put it when you talk about uh, tribals. Um. So. So many, many people, many tattoo artists uh, and customers will, will, many people will have the in, notion of that uh, tattoo style is uh, a tribal style is, uh, is one, it's so many different tri people in the world, different culture uh, in the world, so can give you different styles to your tattoos um, and this kind of thing. And like if and also for example, if you talk about something that is um, is mainstream, can be main not so much mainstream in other places in the world. Uh, for example, I think uh, many for because of if you have a different culture, you also have will have different tattoos tattoos even in the modern time even today you have styles that for example if you, maybe if you go to example Indonesia or Burma, you have one different styles, so it's very popular there, 
uh, comparable what is very popular here in Europe, like in Sweden or in uh, Dam Denmark or Norway or England uh, or in France. You have, will have different styles because of different aspects of culture. And then obviously you have that, and it's also very uh, big, is that... Um, like when, okay, for example, a trendy thing is a thing, for example, when it's a popular object, for example, if you talk about, for example, Spider-Man as tattoos, not maybe not anymore, for example, Spider-Man, or you talk about, for example, Joker, uh, Joker tattoos with the, with the villain in Batman, the Joker, uh, with photorealistic style, it's very, very popular. So it's often the style, and the, uh, the, the and the topic of this so the style is one is one thing to make it and then the thing you have so you for example you have uh the the tiger king for example and you have uh, and you make go to a very famous tattoo artist and you make that tattoo in photorealistic that tattoo will be very popular because that is a popular thing because uh, uh in a very famous popular thing and then it's a popular style put together. You have two popular things put uh, it's together, and you get very. That is something that will be uh, mainstream. And for me personally, my personal opinion is just my personal opinion is that. Um, is that I think it's much more. It's much cooler to have. Uh, to. To have tattoos that is different from from the masses, the massive, the massive comparable because I think I think one thing I want to say that is I think it's uh, one tattoo artist say it and it's very cool that that she say uh, and is that yeah is that you have the best idea you can get it from you is from your head from you from your own mind how you where you see how you inspire what you see how to put that thing where you see together to make something cool cool thing of that to a tattoo i think it's the most cool thing you can do because it's this much more thing much more uni uniquity individual individuality individuality to that thing if you think for yourself when you do when you get the tattoo because if for example if you, if, for example if you look at pinterest uh, or uh, oh yeah pinterest you will sometimes it's almost like you take a tattoo from somebody else but you, you it's very i think for me it's pinterest very um um I think it's, it's, it makes tattoos very sometimes a bit boring. It's just my opinion. People do what they want to do. I just say that. Um, that that the thing is that um, because you have, for example, this is very popular right now. It's uh, roses uh, and clocks, and obviously. Um, uh, human heads with anim human heads with animal heads over it, like tiger heads, lion heads, panthers, uh, bears, uh, other animals. But most of uh, all of it's the tiger and lion. It's very mainstream to have that with that style with the head and the tiger uh, over it, like a Hercules or Mithridates, um, have. So for me, it's like, I think, I don't know why, I don't know why people um, go mainstream. Uh, I don't say that people don't go mainstream do bad, is it bad. No, it's not nothing about that. It's nothing about the per person, individuality, visually about the person. It's much more that I think it's much more fun to do things that it's very rare to see. And I don't mean if just because it's rare that it will be good. I don't say that. I just say it's much more interesting to see rare things uh, with tattoos. And obviously, it's obviously when you have something that is more, is much more rarer. 
is you have to be that then you have to be prepared for that maybe if you for example if you want to be something have a very um if you want to have a tattoo that is a very example uh, will be high rank for example if you do, example to say for example the top five best tattoos in the world um you, then you probably have to do a tattoo that is a, a mainstream style and a mainstream topic and you have to find uh, the third thing you have the third thing you have to find a good tattoo artist for these three things because if you do something that nobody else have seen and no, not so many people knows about what that is symbolizing but just you know yourself what this mean and you know that you like it then you have to just find the things you like because if you is that is the, the thing here with tattoos in some place sometimes is that um a style for many people like for example if you talk about music and you say for example if you talk about example we make it a, a category of music we say uh, okay heavy metal is many different styles of metal music okay when we say metal music in in the whole whole case and you talk and you should play something that people will know very much for example in metal radio for example uh, radios play metal music different kind of metal music but uh, but it's very mainstream metal radio to be mainstream for example you play five finger death punch uh, slipknot corn Marilyn manson uh, um, Trivium or uh, Kill Switch Engage, uh, especially Slipknot, and then you play, um, right? Other, for, for example, Ghost. Uh, many people obviously will know Slipknot, but the point here is every of these bands is very good, there's very good bands, but you draw more attention because they are fa more mainstream. Uh, a, a mainstream can be good and bad. I don't mainstream is do not mean that it's bad or, or bad or not uh, bad or not good. It just mean that it's more people drawn to that thing for different reason. Um, so that I think that is the thing so for me personally with my tattoos. I always go for tattoos I want and tattoos that is much more preferred for me. And I know when I choose tattoos, I know that um, that maybe my tattoos will not have as high um, ranking or will ha have ha as as popular topic as other um, tattoos. It just because I show I I show I take things that is very sometimes not all the time and sometimes different. Uh, and because I want to have something that is mine, uh, my own tattoos, and something that is uh, different in my opinion, then maybe it's not for the other person, uh, different. Um, but I think it's much harder, I think it's much more harder nowadays to, uh, to get tattoos that is very unique, it's very hard, it's harder and harder for everyone. Uh, every year you have to be very sometimes quick how what kind of tattoos you 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 want to create you want to get because lots of things um uh, yeah you have to be just quick with different things and with tattoos and this kind of thing yeah and that is one uh one topic of the whole things uh then you have oh, other other thing is obviously uh with that is when you yeah it's also i think for example um for example when you also other other thing with um, the thing is that to uh, sorry Okay, the other thing is also that you have, um, no, sorry, okay, you have you have something that I think the, the styles I talk about, uh, the different ones is popular, and it's very cool to, for example, to see, for example, if, when, if it's one, 
group on Facebook that is very very cool. Uh, I think they're called uh, un uncommon uncommon tattoos uh, uncommon tattoos. Um, and you look at that, you look at this the tattoo different tattoos there. And you see very cool diff different ways of tattoos because it's very uncommon tattoos. And then you s then example you look at the best tattoos on uh, the best tattoos on Reddit, and you see much more. You see um, a very different side of tattoos. You see one is much more uncommon tattoos, that is people some makes um, can get tattoos that is very different, um, uh, and. I think different is very cool. It's cool to have a different stat, uh, different tattoos, a different um, kind of things that is very rare, very rare to see. Uh, and I think that is I'm more drawn to that uh, a, a group of Facebook with the uncommon tattoos because it's very cool to see tattoos from different places in the world and to see how when people get things that maybe not going to be put in to uh, best tattoos on reddit because reddit have very i think i like more facebook in that sense with tattoos because reddit is very strict and it's almost you have almost like a classic class kind of tattoo style class system when you only have one very very like main very like a mainstream kind of uh, style of the tattoos and this kind of thing so it's very much um sorry it's very much more like you exactly like um i don't know for example like joker or um uh, it's very it's very much popular things comparable to uncommon things uh, and this kind of thing um, yeah yeah and so yeah and that is just the that my talk about I want to talk about the thing I talk about tattoos and now I want to talk about different uh, subject of subject is, uh, is is nothing to do with tattoos now in this part of the video is much more for example talk about uh, in the chapter uh, in one piece and that will be the chapter 997 97 and uh, and obviously this will be a spoiler for the people who have not have read read the chapter yet only watch the manga yes yeah, so this is a spoiler and so we start in the beginning that uh, Sanji hear a uh, woman's voice that she will uh, she is attacked of, uh, of a, a man and Sanji he ran up to the stair to, to say try to save that woman he think yeah she tried to say when he yeah so he opened the door he was tricked and attacked of two uh, um, different characters that uh, work for um, Black Maria and Black Maria is one of the uh, top robots and my and uh, the thing with Black Maria is that my speculation about her and her devil fr devil fruit is that he she is the jo uh, young young gunder no sorry no that she is the the mythical spider in japanese mythology and 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 because yeah this the, the different the story of the spider queen that she is uh, always drawn a man and because she was a beautiful woman and then she was uh, transformed to a spider to eat them up and this kind of thing and obviously Sanji fought for that because yeah it's Sanji um yeah this kind of thing so that that is one part of the chapter with that Sanji and then uh, Monkey D. Luffy run with Jinbei and then uh, uh, Chopper find the, uh, the cure from uh, for uh, the against the virus the Queen's ice demons uh, virus and he explained you have to need you use you have to use fire to stop it and then we have marco obviously there's so i have healing flames because he is, his devil fruit is the uh, blue phoenix uh so yeah so it's a i think the chapter it was um okay it's okay chapter uh and to see 
So it's interesting, yeah, so we see that, uh, for example, Sauron then destroy uh, Queen's, uh, uh, his weapon, Queen's uh, bazooka kind of weapon. And this kind of thing. So, yeah, I think, well, I th yeah, I think the chapter is, is okay. I think it is not, absolutely not the best chapter. Absolutely not, uh, but it's it's okay chapter for me. It's totally okay. Uh, it's I think it's much more, uh, uh, much for look forward to like um, like a class the more classical one on one fights. Uh, so I hope we will see some of that in that uh, in one -on, like for example Queen, the versus. Uh, uh, Soro and Nico Robin and, and some other um, because I think Soro cannot take down Queen himself and then obviously I want to see Saki's uh, Devil Fruit that I think is a bit, will be a kind of uh, will be a cave bear and then you have Black Maria I think will transform to uh, the, the mythical spider in Japanese mythology um, this kind of thing yeah, so you have you have that you have that in that chapter, and um, yeah, you have that in that chapter. Uh, yeah, so that is. Uh, I think, yeah, I think that is everything I really want to say. It's about uh, obviously this video will be it's a two different part. First, what to talk about what I think about different touch styles and this kind of thing and then this this part what about uh, a short review about um, One Piece in chapter 997 and, and my, so what I think with, with the chapter uh, this uh, chapter 1000 what will happen is uh, probably that is the chapter when Kaido will be defeated and the other thing is probably we will maybe we will it uh, will be we will we will lose uh, one member of the straw hat pirates because i think they he, i think all want to go out with, that is just what i think all will go out with a very heavy punch and uh, to the end to for it is ma not many mangas on have uh, up to 1000 chapters and that is very huge and I think to have a very huge impact uh, maybe not you don't need to have a positive huge impact but you have if you have a very very powerful in some sense maybe that is a better word to say a very much more powerful uh, uh, end result a very powerful impact you m maybe maybe one of the one piece uh, crewmate will maybe die in the chapter again some I don't know. I just this is just a speculation, because um, maybe that is not so. Not will be not will maybe not be. But it's just speculation. Of maybe some. I mean, for example, Nico Robin maybe will die in some sense, because if you have a character like Nico Robin, and Nico Robin what is a character that always. Was tell was told to her that she was not uh, meant to live uh, for for uh, Marine Emerald because she she know she was different and she was always like to have very dark background. Nico Robin have a very dark background and um, and it's almost like oh okay this may be too heavy maybe it's gonna be too heavy the, to make this kind of thing in the thousand chapter chapter thousand. For many people, but you have to understand if that happened, I don't say that will happen, but if that happened, you have to understand that that will be a very risky move to do. But it's also risky moves, it's also that thing that will be much more in end of the thing where it more will be much more developed because you have something you have an artist that is, is willing to put out the system. Of the chapter and make some character that is very very fame popular passed away in the chapter maybe to have to save he her her screw and so that is just why i think it will have the two things maybe that will happen what i think 
in chapter 1000 is that maybe Nick Robin will die because she uh, will die and then Kaido obviously will I think will be defeated but I think they, they're gonna be a, a sacrifice that because I think if you if everybody is safe and everybody come from the island from Wano and Kaido is defeated uh, or Big Mama and Kaido is defeated or something will happen they Big Mama may be, maybe flee I think that the problem is that um, I think because of this so high number of the chapter is a high number you have to have a very powerful end result of Wano because that I think is it's not going to be as powerful if Kaido gets defeated. It's, it's, it's not as powerful because Kaido is okay. Kaido will win, but if you lose a member of your pirate crew, it's much more more powerful. For example, Lord of the Ring. For example, Lord of the Ring. You have the first uh, the first book, and uh, the Fellowship of the Ring, and you have Boromir, and Boromir saves uh, Pippin and the other uh, Hobbit. Uh, uh, no, so, sorry, he, he fight uh, and try to save them, but he he failed in that. Uh, try, but he fight his best against Orokais, and then he gets shot up with uh, the arrow uh, from uh, Lurt, and he was ki uh, killed of three different arrow shots. But he fight very valiantly, and that maybe I think can be the same thing what happened with Nico Robin that when she fight in Vano. Because that is a very, oh, for example, other sacrifice uh, when Gandalf fight against uh, Balrog and he 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 die and come back to life, but it's a very very powerful top moment with the uh, Balrog and Gandalf, and you have uh, Boromir and Orokais. Uh, it's a powerful moment, and I think One Piece probably with that chapter will also have a very very powerful moment. That it may be, it's going to be very sad, but it's still a powerful moment. And I think that is maybe, maybe will, maybe it's a big possibility that will happen. Uh, with Nico Robin will uh, pass away because you have a character um, that so maybe with, can take her place if she die. Uh, I don't say that I, I, yeah, that is just what I think. I just think that will happen that she will maybe will uh, die in the chapter 1000 because I think I think that will have a, a very sad but still a very very powerful powerful mess powerful end result um, yeah for these kind of things um, and yeah obviously people will not like that if because um, and but the, the worst thing that can happen in chapter 1000, absolutely the worst thing that can happen of them all, is absolutely the worst. Is that uh, Ace will come back to life and come back and that will be absolutely the worst. That will, if you, I think absolutely that, that will not happen, but that is going to be absolutely the worst if that is the case. But yeah, if, you, if somebody dies, and they come back back to life again in the story, and that would not have the same uh, same impact, uh, and that would destroy destroy lots of the big thing that happened before, and destroy the whole topic of the whole things. And that is maybe that thing same thing with example Sabu. Is that Sabu is almost like Ace, but not Ace. But he have the same uh, devil fruit, and I think it's almost like the same thing. You instead for put because instead for put uh, take uh, put uh, Ace back to life again, you almost take um, a very you almost yeah. You give other person the same powers, uh, and I think that is a bit uh, yeah. I don't know. It's so I don't. But I, I just this is just what I think will happen in the with. We, uh, my speculation what will happen in uh, chapter 1000 yeah and that is everything I really want to say in this video and uh, remember everything what I say in this video is my is my own opinion you don't need to agree with what I say absolutely you don't need to agree 
Uh, so it's no that. So no, that is just my opinion. Um, every part, every person have the right to their own uh, their own opinion, uh, even if people don't really, really, really don't want to agree with that. Uh, because yeah, that is just how it works. We have our own opinion, and uh, yeah. So it's not that not it's not that no no attack against Nico Robin. It's not not attack against that character. It's not attack against Sabo either. I just think that maybe that will be a more, yeah, a, 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 a kind of a, yeah, a, a very dark and very up, very dark end result and powerful end result in the same time of these kind of things. Yeah, hope you like it. Yeah, and um, yeah, bye.